but he fought his way through both of them with his clean Falco play, and we're going to be getting a uh, the dessert of that coming up against one of New York's finest in Jin. Mm -hmm. And it looks like we're already seeing Nexus starting off. Jen we saw in uh, the match against Carflow. Jen's uh, boxing, I think, was so good. Uh, I think both matches, uh, Jen was up against someone whose punish game is so scary, but Jen was able to clutch it out in the um, in the edge guard situations, and that's what we're seeing right now is Nexus off stage. These back airs so good from Jen, and you know, Spacey's historically their weakness has been their recovery. But I'm surprised that didn't punish. And an absolute uh, a, a benefit for Nexus, but he's still finding his way out of so many of these. Yet the lingering hit of Nair, one of the hits that would pull into the multi hit, uh, but that was all he got. So <laughs> kind of looks like he was holding uh, holding shield, trying to match an air dodge, but not able to find it. And Jen is able to take away that with that first stock in tow. Yep, Jen, uh, we've seen so far, is just so good at cleaning up his plate. <laughs> Patient play, just standing center stage. Just narrowly whiffing on the auto reticle, the Falco Phantasm doing wonders for Nexus in so, man in, uh, so many sets at this point, as he went for it again, but got grabbed out of it. Uh, Jen just... Holding steady and holding firm. This is yeah. and uh, Jen has been so good not only, you know, in the offensive of the edge guarding situations, but also the defensive. Uh, his angles with the warp have been great. And that is a pinnacle of patience, yep. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, because it was there was a empty hop, there was an up smash, there was so much pressure on that alone. But Jen saw it all and he, now he sees a bird without his jump able to reset that but there's so many instances where nexus is oftentimes burning resources to look for reversal opportunities like that and while that side b into back air is incredible it is a uh, it is something that always tilts falco over the edge and forces you to respect him uh, going to ledge but it's something that jen has just been outplaying and overwhelming nexus because of his lingering hitboxes Once again, uh, got a starter, but wasn't able to convert off of the up throw. Now has Jen off stage. Jen's downward angle warps have been so good. Ooh, down throw into back air, though. Boy, little shades of ultimate prior. Mm -hmm. and it's a. I mean, it, combo's not true anymore, guys. Don't no. don't let it fool you. Not even on fast followers, but. It looked like it was uh, the DI was a little bit late, and Nexus realizing that is like, oh, you know, I, like I'm di I'm DIing down away. This should be fine, but didn't hit a button. Got blown up for it. Yeah. Even if <laughs> back air is still a follow up, even <laughs> if you if you don't do anything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, looks like we're gonna be going on at town and city. Nexus with the color swap. Uh, what do you think about this uh, counter pick for Nexus? Uh, I think this is a great stage. I think this is a great stage for Falco. I think multiple Falco has many uh, f phenomenal stages. Uh, most most commonly being triplats, which were of course banned. But this still adds similar stuff that uh, that Falco can really attest for. It offers a uh, multiple unique platform layouts that help with uh, recovery mix-ups, as well as with combo extensions. Those high platforms being amazing for uh, up like up tilt down air chains. And then it can sometimes turn into FD, which, if you're in advantage, can be a pretty strong thing. Nowhere for your opponent to land, nowhere for your opponent to go, except into that incredible up tilt as yeah. Nexus takes the first stock. Nice patience by Nexus. Uh, delaying the Phantasm a little bit not to get hit by the uh, down tilt, but that time, going to be taking it. Nexus wanted the ledge. Yeah, run from it. It, can, it is inevitable. Uh, just like <laughs> just a couple of uh, ridiculous tilts every now and again from both these players. But the late hit of Nair combo, uh, getting the grab afterward, could have been a lot for Jen, but wasn't able to find any sort of follow up after the down throw. Meaning Nexus can look at his bevy of uh, go to that bevy of punish game, and his combo game has been immaculate thus far, up there with the best of them. 
Yeah, Ooh. the same thing can be said for Jen. Jen was able to get a uh, down throw back air again. Uh, you know, still not a true combo. Yeah, well, not a true combo at kill percent. Right. Wait. Ooh, the pivot Great grab. Kind pivot of, grab. Yeah, it looks like Nexus threw out a back air there either for an A landing or for um, kind of expecting Jen to roll or maybe even spot dodge. But Jen has been really on point with his defensive uh, game plan. And, I mean, offense is no slash either. Just the clean frame traps to put in so much damage. Just single, uh, uh, single strong hits being chained together by Jen's calculating play. Ooh, only gets the soft hit of back air. Jen, we're seeing, uh, is playing so patiently around Nexus, especially right now. Nexus has got to be looking for that uh, that second kill uh, to keep himself in the game. But just not able to find anything. Jen's defense has been so good, and we've even been seeing uh, Jen just kind of standing still, but right there, ooh, Nexus. Not happy about that one. He was just really had to rethink some of those strats as Jen just kind of deconstructed him. It looked so good from previous sets of Nexus looked so good because he was able to find starters, but at least as this set went on, he just became so much more. As we get to, we got a slow motion, we got to get a nice look at that frustration, slapping mm -hmm. his own leg. It was. It looked so good for Nexus when he was able to find those starters because he was able to use that uh, Falco's incredible flow chart and Falco's inc uh, incredible like coverage game in advantage. But Jen basically said, "No, I'm not gonna let you maintain advantage, and you're gonna spend a long time hunting for stocks like these up smash out of shield. I'm respecting it, but if you keep pulling the trigger, I'm gonna start punishing you for it." Mm -hmm. And punish he did <laughs> very frequently. <laughs> Has uh, great stuff from Jen just to kind of cement the Falco counterplay that most New Yorkers would have to learn at this point. Because mm -hmm. I mean, there's there's a couple other there's uh, maybe a Falco in uh, that frequency, you know, that you you know you kind of have to respect a little bit now and again. Uh, speaking of the devil, and he may appear. This is oh, this is an interesting one. It is going to be Tilde that aforementioned devil <laughs> <laughs> the the demon of Zeno as of recently taking so many uh, diff taking so many Zenos out, out of quarantine including last week and then extra O who you saw on commentary just a little bit earlier here we go all right Falco Young Link <laughs> 